Is it hard to be thoughtful? I've played enough rounds of this back and forth ignorance, us pretending not to see each other. I've seen your rewards and they're a long time coming. And who you truly are is on the other side of these mountains. Do you really want to go there if it'll take an hour to get back again? Getting lost on a thousand likes? An hour spent as an extra? That's a question you ask yourself about Los Angeles when you're in the Antelope Valley. It sometimes feels like it's easy to lose a thousand nights, like it wouldn't be hard to be drowned in a thousand lights. Dull fake fame compensating for not enough time spent following simple dreams. Then, when you find new possibilities for growth in San Antonio, you have to ask yourself, is this my first life? Is this my best life? Can I find something to commit to? Can I burst these emotions through enough structure that I build an army around believing in myself? But I know I'm in love with this more than anything else I've done this year. Quit on me if it's too hard. Run away if it's too scary because it's only going to take eight people who need less comfort than change. I'm glad I'm stronger at 30 than I was at 20 and I can remember everything I did in my 20s and not have to fight with that version of me in my memories too many times. I did my best to build a foundation inside myself that would mean something. So I'm ready to fight. Are you? Have you earned your sword? Trump was and always will be a part of what we talk about, but only for as long as America is even part of the conversation. So I ask myself, what do I want to talk about? Culture, progress, laughter, anger, solitude, pain, progress, purpose, providence, honesty, new languages, ways out of things we should never have been in, power, identity, estate, time, being here. This year is all about rest. I'm taking naps in the back seat because my feet are fireworks, but no matter how many times I ask myself, I'm not almost there. And this isn't the 4th of July, and there's no apple pie. This road trip will never end because no matter how many times I stop, I have to pack it up and get moving again. So let's not feel lost because of uneasy circumstances, but accept the things that we still need to fix. All of us, all of me, forever, working first and foremost through introspection. What do I think Michael Jackson was talking about? The man in the mirror. You mean the one who's always been right here, blaming yesterday for today, sacrificing tomorrow just to have more time to figure out how to start changing? That can't be what's happening. This year is about rest. This year is about reprieve. This year is about rest. Because what if five seconds ago was a violin string? And the most beautiful note had just been struck and God had woken up. So what if it took him one billion years to answer? Wouldn't it be worth the wait for the one who created it all? This year is about rest because our bodies are sick and my heart is racing when there's nothing to run from. And I'm leaving so much behind. This year is about rest because this is the best I've ever had it. And if I only have a hundred breaths left, then I should take them without feeling guilty. I'm going to dig deeper and learn how to become part of a team because this year is about rest. And I need to put the parts of myself that think I know better than everybody else to sleep because whether or not I know it, I need you. And you need me because it's you and me and the rest of this city against whatever pain the past has left. And whatever bombs are gonna get dropped in the future, I can see it happening. Writers are finding producers, farmers are finding markets, immigrants are finding countries worth living in. Our work is the key we need to unlock a future where our destinies are the guide to fulfilling our identities. We will build Nigeria, Mexico, Liberia, the Philippines, and every country like them. We will build them to sit on the treasure of their long suffering and empower the peace they need to rediscover the opportunities art can create. The artists who live in those cities, in those countries, have always been the ones to sleep their way through all the dust and raised fences. And if we look them in the eye, we can move with them. All I know is that the time for shy lovers is done. So grab hold of the face that's locked in your gaze and make a way out.